Hey everybody, Chris here and welcome back to another comic book review. This time I'm talking about the Futures and Green Lantern core one-shot spotlighting Jon Stewart. And at first after reading this I felt Jon Stewart was very out of character, but after really thinking about it and talking with a few people from uh, the group, I actually agree that after everything Jon has been through, especially in the past couple of story arcs, this is the way he would go. So... We're five years in the future, and John is now one of the um, deadliest, let's put it, Green Lanterns uh, in the core. He has the most kills uh, of any Green Lantern in the core. Um, he's very reckless. His point of view is, point me in the direction of uh, whom you want me to kill. So, they want to leave Mogo, and they want to go back to... Sector Zero, Oa, they want the old world back, but it's been taken over. Von Dangle and, um, Von Dangle and, what's her name? Ramey Hall actually went there, and they're prisoners to, um, oh, what was his name? Um, to the, the Green Lantern, the young Green Lantern who didn't speak much. I forgot his name. But anyway, we learned that that's one of the Green Lanterns who didn't make it past the recruits. Um, John Stewart goes in to save the day. He saves them, and of course, he wants to kill um, Marco. Maro. Maro. His name is Maro. And he actually attempts to kill him, and then Indigo One shows up, and she's there actually looking to recruit uh, a new Indigo. And. John Stewart says, don't get in my way. This is what has to be done. She's like, you have a lot of um, regret. And she takes him to where, um, uh, what was it called? Zanshi once was the planet he destroyed, or the planet that was destroyed because he couldn't get there in time. She talks to him about Mogo, how, it was, um, how he had taken him out at one time. And then she brings him to um, Zezin, which is where... He found out that Fatality was a, um, oh god, I can't believe I, I forgot what they were already, a, um, Durlan, and that's basically where the beginning of the end of his relationship with Fatality started, and then we find out that once the ring was taken off of her finger, the love she had for him was all forced by the ring, and basically Jon Stewart was never the same again. He kind of goes into a bit of a rage and uh, ends up stabbing Indigo 1. And here's a bit of a spoiler for you, even though the cover basically said it all. Indigo 1 was looking for a replacement, and her replacement was none other than Jon Stewart. So Jon Stewart actually realizes, you know, um, what did I do? I, I didn't mean it. And he's like, you know, I... Um, you know, he realized everything he's done up until that point was wrong, and... Well, not wrong, but he start, you could see that he's starting to regret it, and, he, and obviously he's in a lot of regret that he just basically killed Indigo 1. So he loses his Green Lantern ring and gains the Indigo ring, and he becomes the leader of the Indigo tribe now. Definitely something I wasn't expecting, but again, in Green Lantern, Hal Jordan is now part of the Source Wall because he sacrificed himself um, to stop... Um, forgot his name but anyway to stop the new black hand John Stewart is now an indigo and from what I'm seeing in Red Lanterns um, Guy Gardner is going to be a blue lantern possibly so this is a very interesting future for the Green Lanterns out of uh, five stars I would definitely say a three and a half to close to four stars um, John Stewart's gone very dark it gets very dark five years from now so it's it's uh, Dark time for the Green Lantern books, I guess. Well, we'll see how Sinestro, uh, New Guardians, and um, Red Lanterns go. But till then, guys, don't forget to check out Comic Related, Comic Frontline, and Zone4Podcast.com. Together, we are your number one source for comic related news, reviews, and a whole bunch more. Uh, don't forget to check back here for more futures end as the new books come out. This concludes last week's books. This week's books are about to begin. So until next time, everybody, take care, keep reading, keep collecting, and I'll see you guys in the next review.